Hey, good evening viewers. This is Jolly Poultry once again. With us is Kefuja and Ian, wonderful young men. Kefuja is in Form 4 and Ian is in Form 3. And they are here to share the experiences. There is no going back to school the whole of this year. Which plants did they come up with and what are they doing? So, Karibuni Sana Kefuja and Ian, there are a few of the things that you people have been doing and what is keeping you afloat. Okay. Uh, uh, then we started uh, farming bees. Okay, to be on the, like, uh, it's already two weeks in Asia. Uh, oh, sorry, uh, one month. Yeah, uh, we, uh, we came up with an idea of uh, keeping some chicks uh, from uh, which we take from jolly poultry. And now we have to make like two, a set of 200, yeah, mm -hmm. which was our uh, starting capital. Mm -hmm. uh, the 200, let's say, it cost around uh, 22,000. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, we were able to to kaza kuzime kuzilea until the kafika point of three weeks where we were able to sell them, and uh, we we passed through some challenges. Mm -hmm. One mm -hmm. of them zilipufa at first, mm -hmm. which we didn't get discouraged because kila kitu na ishi lazima tunajua tu ina kupanga, which is a challenge. So uh, after selling the two hundred chicks. Two hundred after kutu is a jazzy kufa. How many did you sell? We sold uh, six, one, seven, seventy-six. Yeah. Okay. So how many died out of two hundred? Twenty-four. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we got a profit from the one hundred and seventy-six chicken, thanks to God. And uh, from the profit we got, instead of taking the money in a car village, we saw it's better off investing the money. In the same, in the same, uh, in the same business that we were doing. So right now we have uh, a total of 500 chicks, which we took from Jolly Poultry, thanks to Madame Teresa, uh, and the farm is large, and we really appreciate, and we say thanks to God and to our parents, and to Jolly Poultry. Uh -huh. yeah. And how much are you planning to make from the 500? We are planning to make like. Uh, uh, okay, a hundred, a hundred K, mm -hmm. which we will manage, you know, God will help us to manage it. Mm -hmm. And we say that, uh, that even as we go back to school, we say that we to be able, you know, our moms struggle a lot uh, to get maybe school fees. And afterwards, we can, we can, uh, the money that we'll be making, mm -hmm. it can help us to, uh, to pay our uh, courses, which maybe or else our uh, college. So we, we pray to God that we'll go uh, that far. Uh, and we pray that uh, those uh, who are watching us there, uh, those, uh, our age mates, we pray that you also you can see uh, what we are doing. So uh, you, can, uh, you can plan, you can come up with plans and ideas. Uh, don't, see, don't just see it out or else uh, See it, uh, you can also plan and have ideas. You can you can you can start small businesses. You can you can keep even for uh, some chicks. There are many ideas that you can do. Yeah. The government talks about youth em employment, eh? yeah. or youth and and employment. Mm -hmm. Do you think chicken has a future? Do you think you can make your livelihood from chicken from the little experience mm -hmm. that you have had? Yeah, because mm -hmm. for me what I can say, mm -hmm. when you look at the people who have been employed by the government, mm -hmm. it's a small number compared to people who are farming and doing their own businesses. Mm -hmm. So for me what I can say, business mm -hmm. has created a, a job opportunity for a lot of people. Mm -hmm. We are not saying that we, we are not supposed to study. Mm -hmm. As for me, and I'm not bragging, I'm mm -hmm. in a national school. Mm -hmm. But apart from learning, mm -hmm. you still have other 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 things that you can do mm. their talent their ideas and 
their skills mm-hmm. because as you look for jobs mm-hmm. as you learn in school mm-hmm. you are asked what's your experience yeah. what experience do you have in mm-hmm. life right? mm-hmm. if you have none mm-hmm. your uh, uh, your opportunity of getting the job and a person who has an experience mm. your ex- uh, your ex- your opportunity of getting the job is much higher mm. more than the person who doesn't have the opportunity true yeah. wow great so what do you aspire to do in future if we do, what is it that you want to go and do in college? Okay. Uh, I, I would like to, to do agribusiness. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Which, okay. uh, that, that, that is one. Mm-hmm. Also, if, I, if, if God, uh, I know God will help me, mm. I can also uh, do catering. Uh, I, love, I love cooking Ooh. a lot. In the le- uh, you're in the right industry, eh? yeah. you produce and you cook. <laughs> yeah. Wow, and you, Ian? For me, my first choice is survey. Mm-hmm. And my new, uh, I love music, mm-hmm. so I would like to do music production mm-hmm. or music engineering. Wow, thank you so much. We appreciate you, Kifuja mm-hmm. and, and Ian. You can be sure that you have my support. Mm-hmm. I actually visited because I have seen your dedication your love for what you're doing and the passion that you have. That as many as we have young people not sure what to do now that schools have been closed, you have decided to engage your brains. So it's my prayer first that this, what you're doing keeps you busy, but also gives you an income that you can say next, next uh, when schools open, that mom, don't worry, I have enough school fees uh, for myself or I can pay my college fee, which is very exciting. Yeah? So let's walk this journey, you can be assured. I will walk with you and I want to see you success, succeed, okay? So God bless you. Thank you so much for our viewers. Please encourage this young man and it is possible. Youth and uh, youth can also make it in agribusiness. God bless you.